Hi everyone, I'm Scott Rutberg and I'm half of the Gastropoetics team, along with my collaborator Talon Memet. Last year we brought you the Limerick Diet, which was a live cooking event with a generated menu of limericks. This year, in light of the COVID-19 situation, we won't be getting together to cook for a large group of people. Instead, we'll all be cooking at home, together. I'm going to show you our new menu generator, Quarantine Quatrains. This is a poetry generation system, which produces a four course menu, along with a cocktail. I just want to show you very quickly how to operate this device. We'll be using it during the events we're performing at the ELO conference this year with uh, test kitchen uh, preparations of dishes from a menu that we'll generate together so that everyone participating in that conference can cook the same meal. However, there are a plethora of other options available to you. For instance, if you would like to have a cocktail, you just click on the cocktail icon here and it generates something like Solowitz Pandemic Boilermaker, which is a drink with three ounces of bourbon, two ounces of Campari, and a splash of oyster sauce. Now, if I didn't like that drink, I would just click on the cocktail again and pour myself a new one, like the Don't Drink That Bleach Magic Kingdom Red List, or the Endgame Magic Kingdom Postmortem, or the Plague Year Plague Zombie. We can also think about food now. For instance, if we want to have an amuse bouche, we could end up with something like, in Florida, they always start things right with three alarm hot sauce on gator bites. Or let's commence with something spectacular, fish cakes with tomatoes and smoked mackerel. Now, all of these recipes have been prepared specifically by us to not be bad. So any combination that you get should end up tasting good, perhaps with the exception of the cocktail. For instance, the New England Quahog Marinara, steamed scallops resting on leek saute, topped with delicate bell pepper pickles, the balsamic coulee sur flambe. This coquette of seafood is not for the fickle. Or the drunken mollusk Rockefeller. Now, we won't be telling you exactly how to cook these meals because we don't really know yet how they'll be prepared. In fact, part of the fun of the Quarantine Quatrains project is that each of you will interpret each poem differently. For instance, the precarious fishy fish apocalypse, here and now a platter of leek steam, and blood orange poached herring, an orgiastic scene, basil and pistachio hold high esteem, sprinkled with buttery nectarine. Now, the ingredients are listed there for you, but you could include others if you choose. We expect that many interesting dishes will emerge from the same recipes, and we're hoping that everyone will be sharing photographs uh, with us of the dishes that they prepare. Anyway, that's a quick introduction to the quarantine generator, and we hope that you'll be cooking along with us and enjoying this culinary experience. It's a tool for quarantine.